Hello, welcome to a quick video showing you how to bind the serial telemetry receiver from Spectrum, the SPM4649T. So what you need is a 5 volt source or anything matching the receiver voltage, a bind plug and a power source basically. So if you don't have a bind plug you can just cut the blue and the black wire and short them. That's basically what this plug does. So we'll connect this here and then power and ground, don't mess this up, and ground and 5 volts and then it should basically go into bind mode as, well it's actually a new battery, It should uh, go into bind mode as soon as I plug this in, so you can see it's flashing. I already named the model, but that's not needed. I push the bind button and power it on. So normally you would want to have some space in between both of them, but basically that's it. So you will see it binds this disk, makes 22 milliseconds telemetry, and now this uh, the light is solid. So it's bound, you see the reception is in here, and then you can remove the bind plug, or you can basically remove the tire harness, and it's bound. And I will show you again that it's working. Ground. So, green light and RSSI, or reception, or less. So a cool thing I can show you is to not bind in that mode, but to go into system settings. That's wrong. Frame rate, and set it to 11 milliseconds. Then you do the same thing again. You could have set that up before, but I wanted to keep it basic first. So you put this one in bind mode, bind plug, turn that one off, turn that one on. So you see it's blinking again. And I do the same thing again. And you'll see it will say 11 milliseconds, hopefully. Okay, that's weird. <laughs> Let's try this again. Oops. As mentioned, it sure can be a problem that I'm so close. You shouldn't do that. But for video purposes, I'm still gonna try it. Oh, that's okay. Now you see 11 milliseconds and I hope telemetry pops up. Yeah, there it does. Awesome. Okay, so much for our tutorial. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.